What's going on, explorers? Brandon Abandon, 6'4", Explorer with Urbex Dicklin. I got an awesome little spot for you guys here today. Now, it's not decayed, it's none of those houses, but it's abandoned for, I think it was five years, eight years, something like that. It's a beautiful house. There's not much left behind except for the awesome architecture and the details that are left around. So you guys are gonna love it. My first time here. Let's do it together. Let's jump right in there. Right there's your beautiful front door. Nice big window. Nice light. See, we got the brick, the wood. I like different textures in houses, it's awesome. And nice carpet all the way through. If I come to this side and show you. See, so you walk in from there. You got that area. Very big, little main front room. Nice skylight. Some kind of fancy lights here. This is kind of weird though, isn't it? This different section of carpet. Maybe this is where they had a table. Something like that. In this house, it's nice. Nice wood on the outside. A nice dyed red. Almost looks like it was on fire at one point. And now this time of year, it's gonna look like the grass has been cut. But mainly it's just the grass hasn't started to grow yet. cool little way to get downstairs we're not gonna go there yet beautiful fireplace here it's weird that somebody's got some paper in there hopefully nobody's planning on starting a fire and now let's go this way around No power, there was no, uh, no water. I thought this was detail on the door, but it's not, it's the paint starting to pop up. This is a neat little kitchen. Somebody took the fridge. Nice wood, nice tile, old school. Another way to get to your backyard. Bathroom's got a little cottagey feel to it. I like the nice blue tile though. Vibrant. <laughs> That's cool. For your heat light, they've got their own hand dryer. Beautiful sun. The whole house is starting to creak as I walk around though. Very nice, nice door. The old school tile on the walls in here. It's weird. We got a light, a light in the shower. But I guess it is its own tiny little room there. Another nice 
blue row. The nice plaid paper down there. Still got your nothing in the closets. Well, this is a cool little room. The ceiling though. Not very high. And it slants. <laughs> oh. Yeah, it smells like a cottage in here. It smells nice. It smells cottagey. I like it. It's got that kind of a wood smell. Your electric heat. This door almost looks like it just goes. Well, we'll make our way through there. A beautiful room, though. Nice wood. Clean, slanted windows. Tiny little bathroom with a bidet. It's pretty cool though, and they even had their own little sinks out here. <laughs> the area that I'm in, it's not the, it's a very richy area. So for that moment there, because there was a big window, I was down on my knees. Didn't want nobody to see me driving by. Nice use for cupboards. But they're all gonna be empty. There's another room. Built-in shelf. Again, they've got the cool slanted windows. This whole house has got a cool slant ceiling roof. Now it's starting to smell damp in this room. Almost a little, a little mildewy. Empty closets. A nice blue room. Beautiful windows again. I like that, especially since it matches the blue. And you know me, I love globes, I love maps, I love the books. I didn't notice, but the roof in here is stucco. Has it been like that all over? Uh, let's just go in here and take one peek. Nope, this, these ceilings are flat. So I would have pointed that out right away if I had seen it, like I did there. That's strange. You can tell here by the way the roof is, it's cracking a little bit, but it looks like they just, they didn't re-drywall over the stucco. Looks like they just strictly uh, mudded, plastered over. Nice big mirror. Whoa. That's pretty nice. Not the biggest fan of that color, but I'll take it. And then from here, we're back to the front. This house has a very cool layout. Like that was easy to walk around in a circle, see everything. I liked it. Now we're going over here to that basement. All right, explorers. Let's make our way down this really groovy staircase. Starting to get a bit of a, bit of a damp smell down here. Yeah, definitely, look at that. Not nice.
see from here there's stairs to get up. That crow's going crazy. A few cans. Okay. Ah, I almost thought the basement was going to be a lot different than it is. That's really cool though. It's quite the space age shower. A dome. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Well, perhaps I was wrong. Maybe I'll have to do a double check. But this might be <laughs> old school uh, pencil sharpener. This might be it for the basement. I don't think there's going to be another way in. I'll do a check. I'll look around, but I don't think so. There's not much going on in here. Some work stuff. Some storage stuff. It's big, though. Like, I don't understand. Like, they've got some carpet. But they should have dug this out the whole way. You know what I mean? Like, look. It's pretty much just a crawl space now, unless you're four foot tall. But if they had to dug this out, the basement down here would have been huge. I don't know what they were thinking on that one. Builders got lazy. Because yeah, that's it for, for this half anyway. <laughs> if this is just a half, but I don't know. I think this might be the whole basement. So out here. Beautiful little balcony area. Got a couple really nice lights. Let's take a peek out here for a minute. I don't know if anybody went into the garage. It's open. We got a couple nice couches. Some chairs. Little tables, little containers. I don't want to stand in front of this big window right here. That's why I'm doing it from over here. I hope that's okay. Those are nice chairs. Very cool. These couches aren't in the best condition no more. cool though even the garage is on an angle this whole place was built like a triangle it's very cool all right explorers this one's gonna be short but it was a really cool house it's not gonna be here much longer so I had to get it in I had to show you guys I hope you guys enjoyed it just the brick the stone the wood I love when houses again like I said are different textures it just adds to the place makes it feel so cool like it, subscribe it, share it. Thank you for the comments, for the love, for all your views, for your support. Brandon Abandon, I'll catch you on the next Explore. Ciao.